<laughs> camera acts for Ben, why not, dude? We're back to the interval today. On the assault bike. Alright, here's the warm for today. Five minutes on the assault bike, moving into five intervals of 20 seconds and 40 seconds rest. My main man, Ben. Alright, so what we're starting off with today. We're doing some banded bench press. We're gonna build ourselves up a little bit in resistance. Same thing with the Bulgarian on the superset. And then for a little active recovery, as well, we're gonna do an ascending speed, little two minute jog. We're gonna start with a very, kind of a light tempo. And we'll build ourselves up to something like 7.5 out of, out of 10 on the intensity scale. So we're gonna try to incorporate as many muscle groups as we can. Especially in the beginning of the workout, we're gonna really try to ramp up the big compound movements to get as much uh, neurological stimulus as possible, get all these multi-joint movements, get all those muscles activated. We're sprinkling a little bit of that active recovery in there, um, not, not to full fatigue, but allow our body to, again, recover between uh, the big supersets of those compound movements so we can keep ourselves at full blast once we come back around our set and keep maximal caloric expenditure to keep ourselves as lean as possible burning that fat. Band training, so awesome. A little bit easier on the joints. The resistance increases as you press through. Ooh, really helps the uh, the chest and the shoulders and the, and the shoulder blades, the scapula stabilize. A little gym hack. Use a leg extension or hamstring curl to set your foot on and it's a lot more comfortable than getting yourself on the back of a bench or a box or stool or anything like that. Let you relax that foot a little bit better. Nice brother. Set number two with the purple band, considered the heavy band. We're just adding about 20 pounds each time, slapping a little 10 on there. How many reps did you get on that first set, Ben? 12. Okay. A couple key tips. Try to keep your posture as straight as you can through that Bulgarian. So therefore, that hip creases fully and the glute gets all the stretch, the hamstring, gets that interaction, beautiful. And that's where that compound movement really comes into play and will really help balance out the two legs. Each time we go back to that treadmill, we're up that tempo. Start at seven, gonna finish at eight. <laughs> Come on, baby. Woo. Last set. First set, second set, third set. <laughs> Good job, bro. There we go. I haven't heard that one out of you. That's a new noise. <laughs> Good job. That was awesome. Woo. Okay. Part two. Superset. Incline dumbbell chest press. Here we go. Straight up. There we go. Part three, 
How are you feeling, Ben? <laughs> Now, time for the special treat. Woo, cool down, hell yeah. Hell yeah, I'm gonna chill my boy out, Ben, with the Hyperize Hypervolt. The attachment I prefer is a little double prong guy here. I like it because it gets a little bit more focus as far as that trigger point emphasis. It can help separate the muscle tissues a little bit better than like the blunt hammer end that you might see on these guys. So, check it out. Thank you.